What's up guys, Dan here, Cold Cracker Bushcraft. Do zippers ever just get you down like frustrated and totally upset? Like, especially if you find a really cool old bag or an old backpack, maybe at a flea market or at a garage sale, and then you go to open it up and you're like, oh, that zipper is a hot mess. I am not getting involved with that. Well, I'm here to tell you I've been in that boat before and I've passed up really good items because I'm like, that zipper shot. And then I learned this really hot tip about zippers. And that's what I'm here today to show you and tell you all about this hot zipper tip. And um, I think this is an important one for all of us to know. First, if you're like me, um, you love this, that old vintage feel and look to stuff. So uh, most likely some of that gear is gonna have metal zippers. And secondly, if you bought anything off our website, you know, we use metal zippers all the time. So we're gonna look at how to really quickly and easily condition a zipper. Quick backstory on this bag. This was my grandfather's bag um, that he used to keep his tools in inside his van. And um, I repurposed it for all my trapping supplies. So I do use this all the time, but um, because it's out in the weather and my trap basket lays out and we just have like the Bushman class and stuff like that, I like to take care of the zippers. Um, so I keep this thing intact because it is already, it's getting pretty old, pretty beat up, but I love it. So um, really easy. You're gonna take your bags and you're gonna get a candle. And then light your candle until you have melted wax inside there that you can utilize. So now that my candle has melted wax all throughout it, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take some of that melted wax and I'm gonna start to work it on the zipper. So I'm gonna work it on the top, I'm gonna work it on the sides, all the way around the zipper. So again, top, sides, all over the place. Now, if you get some chunks of wax in there, honestly, it is not going to hurt anything. Um, that wax, as we work the zipper, is gonna distribute itself throughout the zipper, so you will be fine. So, what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna work, again, the whole zipper, both sides, um, the whole way, and then, once we get that done, we'll begin to just work the zipper and distribute the wax. All right, so now my zipper is entirely wax. Now it's time to start working the zipper pull along the zipper itself. Um, I like to just get a little bit of, of speed going on with that. I think that it distributes the wax a little bit better. Um, you can also have somebody hold this for you while you do it, and um, that works fine too. So I'm just gonna work this back and forth, and you should feel that zipper, if it was pretty chunky, to start to move a little bit better across that wax. And literally, that is all there is to putting the wax on your zipper, pretty straightforward process. Now, one thing I will say, and use this please with caution, um, if you realize, hey, I probably put way too, met, too much wax on this thing, you can go ahead and get yourself a lighter, and then very carefully, without burning your bag or lighting it on a fire, just lightly just go over that zipper, okay? It'll melt that wax in, run your fingers over, it'll distribute that excess even a little bit more, and you will be good to go, okay? So don't let those vintage treasures get away from you if the zipper seems like it's a little bit sticky. Now if the zipper's broke, different story, but if the zipper just seems like uh, it's maybe not working too good and you can get it cheap, waxing the zipper is gonna bring it back to life and it's gonna be absolutely glorious. So I hope you enjoyed this quick tip. It's an easy one, a good gear maintenance thing and another reason why you should have candles in your kit um, because you can fix up your gear while you're sitting around camp enjoying yourself. So if you like this video, hit the subscribe and like button below also. So check us out, as always, at coldcrackerbushcraft.com for our classes, our blog, and our merchandise, all that good stuff, and even our bags. Our bags have metal zippers, some of them, some have plastic, most have metal. You get the point. Just go check it out, and then um, until next video, wax your zippers and stay in the woods.